We are two-thirds of the way through the high school football season, and two teams have emerged as the leaders in the North Star League. Both undefeated, both leading their division, and both with big road tests this week. We start in Hillman, where the Tigers have already clinched a playoff appearance and their division title with a win this past weekend against the Atlanta Huskies. The victory also improves the team's record to 6-0, their best start to a football season in over 20 years. But head coach Bill Keenig is encouraging his players to stay humble if they want to continue their success. They may be an older group, but they still can be immature at times, and we just don't want to look past anybody. And uh, you know, sometimes they get a little bit of cocky and a little bit of overconfidence. So we got to kind of keep them humble too. I'm just proud of my boys. Um, they don't back down from anybody, and uh, they stuck with every game. So hopefully, they can keep their heads, and, and we'll win all. Now the Tigers will have to turn their attention to a tough Oscoda team this Friday. The Owls are coming off a win against Alcona and are still in a hunt for a playoff spot. The, uh, the Hillman players know that they can't overlook the Owls and the best way to continue their unbeaten streak is to stay the course. We're just, we're just going to make sure that we stay disciplined and keep playing our game, just keep having each other's back and playing our hard football. I mean, anybody can play our positions in our offense and defense, so hopefully we just continue to play as a team and play strong. The Tigers will come into Oscoda with the leading offense in the North Star League as they average just over 42 points a game. As for the other undefeated team in the North Star League, you have to head all the way down to Whittemore Prescott. The Cardinals are coming off a big win against Tawas this past weekend, but don't have much time to celebrate as they face a strong Rogers City team this Friday. That game's in Rogers City, which means the Cardinals will have to travel nearly two hours north to get there. Woodman Prescott has already clinched a playoff spot and has a chance to go undefeated, but right now they are focused on the task at hand. We have a, a goal of winning every game if we can, and, and, and the playoffs are going to happen, but that's week 10, so we're not even thinking about that right now. We're happy, but we're not worrying about it. We're worried about Roger City. Both Winmore Prescott and Hillman will have to avoid overlooking their opponents this week on the road before they meet up in a great Week 8 matchup that will most likely decide the league champion. 